Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and welcome to the channel. Yes, cheers and salutations from me to you all. And we're going to say thank you, Simon Gobadia and Portia Williams, for acknowledging Deb Chanel's 48th World and the family. Okay? Deb Chanel's 48th World and the family. All right? Simon, next time, put us in your... Uh, what do you call it? Your comment section that Deb Chanel's 48 World and Family helped you celebrate your house and putting the correct pictures in your house because that's what's trending. Trending on social media now. Now, you know, I like to come over to the house and I be looking in the bushes from the bushes um, with my binoculars, like a paparazzi thing. And sometimes I, I, you know, I, I, I be, uh, you know, we call it on the side while waiting for you to come home and just be looking and seeing what we can see, make it do what it do. And it seems you took my advice, son, and you're looking all stiff. Is that a new suit? I think that's a new suit on you, cause it's the one with the stripes you had on when you were uh, going around taking the ladies shopping and shit. I'm tired of seeing that suit now, Simon. We got to, we got to pull up now, babe. We got to pull up. We can't be wearing the same thing and be a billionaire. We can't be wearing the same clothes over and over again. I know you prudent and you like to save money, but we looking good right now. We looking good right now. All right. Uh, let me see if I can bring that picture out. No, I can't bring that picture out. But that is a beautiful picture of Miss Portia Williams. Yes. Uh, your soon-to-be wife, but right now glorified girlfriend, what we got going on right now. But I like the aesthetics. It's starting to look like a home and not a cold museum. So whatever you're doing, I want you to keep doing it, man. I like the outfit you got on. I like them cute white sneakers. Make sure you add, uh, get the ash off you now. It seems like you're shining down now. You, keep, you need to keep it that way. Put that Vaseline on now. Don't be using no lotion. We as black folk, we need Vaseline. Don't make yourself looking shiny like a new penny or nothing like that. But hey, now see that picture on the top of that second floor. That compliments you, Simon, when you're downstairs. And of course, that's another complimentary picture that you put up of, you know, Portia Williams. You know what I'm saying? And I'm glad that you are acknowledging her the correct way. Now, I don't know about that little picture right there kind of giving me like I was back in psychology days taking classes and now uh, you know it's kind of abstract looking type of art I don't like that shit you need to take that down put that in your office somewhere if you want to look at it and be mesmerized or you want to meditate I don't know but it look like a get out picture you know what I'm saying like you're gonna be stuck in a suck sunken place so take that shit off the mountain and put a picture hopefully of you and the kids in Porsche you know what I'm saying not just PJ but I'm talking about the other three siblings she has okay and tell Pasha to stop putting that shit on them about don't block all the haters leave one or two so they can report back to the headquarters yes they're gonna come back to me and we're gonna report what we see if we're not if you're not out there showing and proving what we expect you to be doing then we will come and we will put you on blast okay because you seem like good folk but we don't know because Simon you still ain't let us all in your life I ain't saying you have to let us deep in now but damn just show the comes and goings let us just see you out there visiting your companies talking with your employees hey or having a, a festive employee day lunch shit give the sister give the family something okay but i appreciate you i appreciate you sitting up there listening to me i know you be listening i know you be listening you can't help nothing but to listen because you know i be speaking facts i be speaking truth and i probably gonna got a lot of laughs off you you probably don't laugh at me too but it is what it is hey how you doing give Portia a hug for me Tell her Dale Chanel's 48th world. She can shout me out. Bring me more people over here to the fam. So we can keep eyes on you and her. Okay. Because hey the precious commodities are the kids. 
And we want you to be doing what you need to be doing for all the kids, and that's PJ included, okay? Because we know y'all going to cut the food. Y'all going to be out there drinking, smoking, eating too much, farting, and, and then trying to go to bed, okay? Because I know ain't no sex going up in there, and you don't need to be having sex because you need to work on your uh, physique, okay? I need to, too, so you can call me out if you want to, too. You know, I'm I'm looking like Pillsbury Dough Girl, you know what I'm saying? You push me, I go, whoo! You know what I'm saying? But we can go back and forth with the weight. We, we, we pretty much know where we are with that. Okay? But, you know, the smoking, if you want to live longevity, and, you know, you, you, you got time. Anyway, I don't care how uh, you live life, you treat people right, you ex exercise and eat right. Everybody got a time limit to lead this world. Okay? So, but I'm just saying, because, you know, Portia love you, and I guess your other family love you and care about you. And, you know, deep down inside, I might. I might care a little bit about you. I don't know. It just depends on whatever day we going to. Okay. Because me, me and the family over here, we, we be skeptical. Because you ain't showed us nothing. You ain't showed us what we need to see. Even just a little slimmer. A little piece. Okay. Do what's right. Show us. Okay. Don't show us. Don't uh, track the trailer trucks. And, and, and showing the outside. Hey, we want to go inside. We want to see if you got white folk, black folk, Asian folk, Indians. We want to see what kind of diversity you got in the workforce. Okay. If you providing jobs in the community, we need to see that. Okay. But anyway, I just want to thank you. Yes, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. And the family over here is wanting to thank you too. Because now you're looking like a Liberian African should be. But I'm telling you, take that darn picture off that. I should not see that when I'm coming right in the house. When you invite me in the house, I should not see that ugly picture. I can't stand it. It seems like we're back in the Florida days. If you know anything about psychology, you know where I'm going with it. I need to see more prestigious looking art i need to walk in and say damn i am in a tribal home I, i'm feeling my blackness i'm feeling myself and i got all my sisters and brothers with me okay i got all my artifacts i got all my pictures they telling a story about who i am from the inside out i mean we see you trying to dress a little relaxed i don't know where that coming from you know i pretty much like to have you in a suit and tie every time i see you but we can't all have what we want all right so i i'm, I'm okay with the uh the little outfit you got going on i'm loving that picture at the top and it def it definitely does something for the whole room you see what i'm saying making you look good simon making you look good but you did what you had to do on this uh video i know you did it for me i didn't even really acknowledge it because i'm kind of busy today and i usually go on your, your your instagram account uh here and there throughout the week just see what you're doing just play catch up with you and see if you're towing the line you know what i'm saying but uh, one of my family members, uh, I think her name is Naz Nandez. She told me. She said, "Girl, Simon got you all over there in that house. You better go look. You better go look and see." I said, "Girl, let me go on there and look and see. I can't do it right now, but you know, I had us working on another video. But so I'm gonna go. Before I lay my head down, I said, "My friends, go to bed. Let me go see what Simon doing over there." And looky, 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 who comes cooking? I see all of this beautiful artwork, and it's black. I said, damn, it is a Nigerian that live up in that place. <laughs> Cause right, you know, from the time being, he looked like a European man, a European white man running up there. But you looking like a classy, not trashy, Liberian African. And I'm, I'm digging it. I'm digging in the digs. The home is looking kind of friendly now. Because first it looked like cold, cold and, and metal feeling. You know what I'm saying? No love with it now. Now I can, I can see the love. Got the lights going on. It's kind of bright. I, I like what you're doing. I like. Keep it up. Keep it up. Uh, but yeah, you need to take the other picture off the wall. I'm going to see that no more. That, that's crazy. Put some African art up there. We're black. We're, we're black, okay? We're not white. We're black, Simon. So even though you try to act like you're white, showcase is not deal. But it's okay to be a black Liberian African and, and have wealth. It's okay. When I mean, you go in a white folk house, do you see any black artifacts? Nine times out of ten, you don't, unless it's a mixed racial couple or they're very diverse. They want everything in their house Asian, uh, Caucasian stuff, um, what do you call it, a Native American stuff, uh, just a, a plethora of different type of cultures being represented. Now, if that's what you're trying to do, then okay, but put that picture somewhere else. I should not have to look at it when I'm invited in the house. I should not have to see that picture when I come in. It's kind of frightening me. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the hell going on? You slipping back in some psychology shit? What, what are you trying to tell us? A picture's worth a thousand words. And it seems like you're struggling. When I look at that picture, you're kind of emotionally disturbed. Are you depressed? Got anxiety. Go seek help. Therapy and um, 
medication does wonders okay i'm just saying i'm just saying simon but i like it i like it love it love it and you continue to do that and then i want to get on you every so often but every so often i know you ain't gonna total line every day you're gonna have a cigar in your mouth you're gonna be puffing and puffing next time i'm gonna see you have an oxygen tank round now and you're gonna have to hook it up to your nose you got to be rolling one hand with the oxygen tank and the other hand with your cigar because you know you you pride for like that and you, I, I had some family members in my family. They gone and, and they resting now. But they were avid smokers. And they ended up having, uh, what do you call that, uh, COPD, chronic what call it, pulmonary disease disorder, some, some shit like that. But it's making you hard to breathe, okay? Making you hard to breathe. And we can cut some of that out. Instead of you smoking five cigars or seven cigars a day, cut it down to two. Okay, and I do the same thing over here with my eating habits. Instead of me having like three ginger ale sodas, I tr- I'm trying one and one and a half, okay? It's, it's baby steps we got. I know it's going to be a baby step for you too. But I'm in it, I'm in the fight. I'm, I'm in it to win it just like you are, okay? We go tit for tat, but we, we got one love for each other. Because you stepped out, showed up, showed out, okay? But we need to replace that picture right there. Put it in the, in the closet somewhere. That's where it need to go. Uh, if you got to have something, you know, your own room. You like abstract shit like that. Cool. But we don't want to see it when we walk in your house. We want everything to be friendly. And, and we need to see a place where um PJ is playing in the kids. We need to see a kids room. Now, I know you don't want your shit fucked up. And people dropping shit and all that kind of stuff. But have a designated room for the kids. And now, that's what I'm looking for now. Because your kids should be able to play on the outside as well as the inside and them not have a complex that they're gonna mess up something and then you're gonna get get on them they need to have a space for themselves so i need to see a kid room sooner or later i ain't telling you when to do it because you shocked me you surprised the hell out of me with this and i, I, I I'm, I'm good i might even leave you alone for a couple of days okay but you know when i see shit i don't like i gotta come tell you about it now straighten up and fly right is what my mother always said straighten up and fly right all right but uh yeah, Simon. Okay, that's all I got for you tonight. But thank you for inviting Dale Chanel's 48s were in your house. You're showing and proving. The house feels more warm now. It feels more inviting. I mean, I could damn come over there right now, Simon, and just give you a big old hood. Like, thank you, brother. That's what I'm saying. Show and prove and be there for the people. Okay, you, everybody ain't going to get with you. Because, like I said, we ain't with you all the way. We throwing an olive branch there. We throwing an olive branch. But if you can come this far, straighten up a far right, put some black art in there. Don't stop there now. I need to see some throw rugs on the, you know, like the, we call it a thing when you're sitting around uh, the fireplace. You know, I need to see some of that on the wall as well or on you, you know, just uh, just cute effect that you do on the sofa. Just throw a little uh, shawl over there, you know, so you don't have to be messing with your, uh, your fireplace and everything. Something get cool and stuff like that. But, yeah. Okay, that's all I got to say, Simon. And uh, thank you again for inviting Deb Chanel's 4 Days World and her family over into your family. We like what you're doing, but now I need to see a picture of you and Portia. You know, husband and wife. You know, you being a matri- I mean, a patriarch. She being a matriarch. Uh, and then I need to see a picture of the kids. A painting. Like you did Portia over there. I need to see a painting. I, I don't want to see no Polaroid shit going up there. And you put uh uh-uh. I need you to take that same artist, whoever did that. You could afford it. You're a billionaire. Take a picture of you and her together. That's where you need to put it over that place where you got that weird ass picture. Like I'm, I'm studying psychology again. And I'm trying to figure out what that picture really is trying to say. Crying out for help. That's a, that's a, what the picture we need to call it. Crying out for help. Put that shit in the closet somewhere. Kind of creepy. We don't need it. All right. But put a picture up there with you and Portia, or you and Portia and the family. And then we could definitely click claim. We could say cheers. He finally gets it. It might be a doable situation. Cheers. But that's all I got for this video. Guys, like it, love it. Got to have more. Get down in those comments. Let's dialogue about this situation right here. Now, Simon, he's sitting up here. He watching us. He watching us over here. He done invited us over here saying, look at me now. Look at me now. And I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm seeing you. I'm seeing you. And I'm acknowledging you. I'm acknowledging you. So you make sure you acknowledge me here and there. Or I, I'll get the secret. I'll get the hint again. Either I catch it that you don't took some of my words or inspiration. And I'm made to do what it do. And uh, just inviting people in so they can see who you are. So we can be likable to you. Okay. Because right now at the time you weren't like no likable person. You just trying to be all cold and shit. And we know how to take you. We know how to put up our defenses as well. But 
you showed and proved got art back there and uh, we don't told you what you need to change and do better about and um, we'll just see you next time okay but we acknowledge you because we know you've been sitting over here looking at the video because I'm the only person that I know that's been talking about black art. I'm the only blogger who's been talking about you need to put some black Liberian shit up in there. You need to you need to let me see your culture. And when I come in the house, I can feel the essence of Simon and who he is and what he's all about. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying now. Got no Porsche on like that picture. Take that shit down. It's kind of scary. Probably I'm scared of grandmama and grandfather and, and probably Larry too. Ah, nah, we don't need that. Put that in the room you you are comfortable with. Like your room, everybody have a man cave, I'm pretty sure. I'm sure you got one. If you don't have one, you need to get one. Because when all the women are around you, I know you be ready to run. I know you be ready to run for the hills. So you can go do whatever you need to do. Okay, but just get some ventilation up there if you're trying to smoke in the inside. So it can taper and draw that uh, cigar smell out so nobody can get offended. Because, you know, we're allergy season. We're, we're right in the right horizon of allergy season. People having a hard time breathing and shit. We ain't got time to be, you and a cigar, messing up things. Okay, because Portia Mama old, got the grand, grandmama over there, you know, and you got PJ, you got the kids and your kids, okay? So we don't need to none to be, you know, feeling some kind of way and, and have not to go to the hospital because you don't smoke their asses on out the house. Okay. But that's all I got. I ain't got no more. And I'll see you next video. Good night.